Greetings, today I'm going to be showing you how to farm for lead and steel and gunpowder to make ammo. There's some easy farm points. Um, the first part's going to be this Pleasant Valley Ski Resort. Um, what you're looking for getting is the tin cans, um, especially the tin can traps. So let's go ahead and get started here and I'll show you what I'm talking about. So this is it right here. At this location, you got these three traps here, chimes. They each have nine cans on them. Okay, continuing on with the farming for uh, lead, for gunpowder, and um, steel to make ammo. We are now at Sunny Top Ski Lanes. There's going to be a bunch of tin cans in here, too, to get. So let's get started here. Alright, so this is the first spot. Grab the chimes. Alright, we're continuing with the lead farm. Um, we're here at Horizons Rest. There's normally three paint cans that spawn here. And each paint can will give you five lead. So that's 15 lead right there. Alright, we're at our next location. This is going to be our next location. The Green County Lodge. There's a weight loom in here with a bunch of weights. These weights contain a lot of lead so we'll go ahead and pick them up. You'll probably end up over encumbered from picking all this up. That's five lead, two lead, five. So you can see it's a bunch of lead that gave us. Um, that's a lot of weight too so once you pick this stuff up you head head back into flatwoods to scrap it okay we're back in flatwoods with the dumbbells and we can go ahead and scrap them So, show, so far I've showed you a few locations where to get a bunch of lead and steel. So we're going to hit scrap all junk. And you can see in about 10 minutes you can get 108 lead and 118 steel. And scrap all that. And let's continue on. Okay, so the next spot is the Charleston Fire Department. If we look on the map. Charleston Fire Department. We can go inside here. And there's going to be a weight room. Bunch of weights in it. Go ahead and pick up all these weights again. We got to make sure we get them all. Alright, we got all the weights, and there's actually a workbench in here that you can use to scrap all the weight. So let's go to that workbench. Here it is. We're going to scrap all that weight. 
and you can see just that right there gets you 74 lead. Alright, let's continue on. Alright, we're at the last location I'm going to show you for farming lead. Um, we're at the Eastern Regional Penitentiary. And let's go ahead and get in here and I'll show you how to get some more lead. Alright, we want to go cell block A. In cell block A, there's going to be a bunch of tin can traps. I mean, uh, can traps. So there's one. Should be about nine in total. Here's two more. Three more. Okay, so we collected all the can chimes in the penitentiary. Right here are some workbenches. Go ahead and scrap them. Again, that's got us 58 lead and 111 steel. So, in about 15 minutes, we have collected. 229 steel, 240 lead, and this stuff respawns about every 45 to 50 minutes, and uh, that's, that's the best way of getting lead, just hit up all these locations I showed you, um, go ahead and scrap all that, and now we got a bunch of lead, now I'm going to show you how to get some gunpowder. Okay, we're ready to start getting some gunpowder. I'm at West Tech Research Center. And usually a run through here could take about 15 minutes. I'm not going to show you the whole run. Um, and we're killing super mutants. And we're getting their gunpowder off of them. I get anywhere from 150, 200 gunpowder a run. Um, it's pretty simple. You just roll through here and uh, grab the gunpowder. While you're going through West Tech, a good thing to do is grab up all these weapons they drop. Very good source of steel. And a good thing to scrap for getting mods for those weapons too. Okay, so we've reached the first scrap bench. So we can go ahead and scrap everything I've been getting so far. See each one of these weapons get five steel. Alright, and I'm gonna continue on. Alright, we reached the next scrapping bench, so we'll scrap everything we've gotten so far again. continue on now okay we're back at camp now we can go ahead and get all this ammo crafted um, first thing you want to do is put on ammo smith and super duper and just to recap we got 337 steel scrap and 240 lead scrap and that run took about 30 minutes to do West Tech and go to all the points I showed you earlier in the video to get all the lead. So let's go ahead and craft up the ammo. And I'm be making 556. Five, and oh, I got about a hundred out there in uh, West Tech. 174 gunpowder is what I ended up with. Alright, so let's go ahead and scrap, I mean, um, craft the ammo. We, I'm going to be making 556. Five, five, six. 
and we still got a hundred more lead to go. Should be about right. Okay, so we crafted up all that 556 and that gave us about 2,000 rounds worth of ammo. Um, hope you all enjoyed the video. Hope you all learned something and please subscribe if you enjoyed it. Thank you.